We're keeping it local now this morning for you. A new attraction at Bay Beach Amusement Park will make its highly anticipated debut in just a few days. Are you keeping that excitement down? Yes, I'm trying, okay. trying to, Shelly. <laughs> the new big wheel will open to thrill seekers on the 4th, but a lucky few will get to ride the 100 foot tall Ferris wheel today. That's right. Local Five's Calvin Lewis joins us live in Green Bay with more. Hey, Calvin. Shelly Nate, yeah, good morning. We have been granted special permission, special permission to be walking on the premises here of Bay Beach Amusement Park this morning. All for this, this new, brand new 100 foot looming big wheel Ferris wheel at Bay Beach. I mean, check that out. That, that is just incredible. You know what? Tonight they are having a special, special event. $50 for a ticket to get a first ride on that thing right there that you see behind me there. And uh, proceeds from tonight's event, they all go toward the Friends of Bay Beach. And to tell us a little bit more about that, we have Jason Arnaldi here with Bay Beach Amusement Park. Jason, thanks for joining us. Uh, how does it feel looking at that, you know, this morning and, and, and knowing that some of the first few people to ride it are going to be doing so tonight? I'm just really excited to, to get it going. Uh, it's been something, it's been a project that's been so long in the making. Uh, we started talking about it 11 years ago. And to finally be able to see it with uh, customers on it will, will be great. It'll be very satisfying. And uh, just can't wait to see people enjoying the ride that everyone's worked so hard to get. Right. Lots of excitement here. Uh, and it, it, it's not just only about riding the, the big wheel today. There, uh, there's also going to be a few other side events too, right, going on tonight? Yeah, essentially, uh, you know, a ticket will buy you one of the first rides on the wheel, and then also a commemorative first rider T-shirt, first rider ticket, some snacks. Uh, there'll be some music, and just an, uh, a nice evening for everyone uh, to celebrate uh, our newest edition. Right, and so there, there's also a, a, still a few tickets available for tonight's event. Um, I guess how can how can people get their hands on those? Yeah, tickets are available all day uh, at the main ticket window, and up and through. The event. So uh, even uh, when the event starts, you'll be able to come out and buy a ticket, assuming we're not sold out, and uh, get one of the first rides on the Ferris wheel. Very cool. And uh, obviously, the the crew here they're they're getting it ready for tonight's event. I also just really quickly wanted to ask you: We've had a little bit of rain this morning. What's going to happen in the case of inclement weather with tonight's event? If we if we have a strong driving rain or lightning, we'll likely have to cancel tonight's event and then move it to tomorrow night, uh, and then uh, be ready for Thursday morning when we open to the public. All right, sounds very good. So yeah, so they're going to be opening up to the public on the 4th of July. Very special, 11 a.m. on Thursday. We'll toss it back to you guys over in the studio reporting live in Green Bay. Calvin Lewis, Local 5 this morning.